guys, welcome back to Lima Bean Living. If you are new here, welcome to my motherhood channel. My name is Emily. This is where I take care of all things mom. I just got done throwing Jack his very first birthday party. We got the birthday boy right here. Hey, bud. He turned one yesterday, at least when I'm filming, two days ago if you are watching this on Monday. But I just wanted to do a really quick video and show you some of the highlights, um, not necessarily from the party, like, you know, interactions, but just some of the things that I whipped up and then you will see them in more detail in our party prep video. I will also be doing a very brief cleanup from the party because <laughs> you guys can see it's quite messy, but I did actually reuse like a lot of things that I had for Aubrey's third birthday party, which was a party prep video. I made this little uh, whiteboard art using my Cricut and these are Dollar Tree balloons. So they still held up after a couple days. I also reused our Halloween like table skirt that I made because it takes a long time and I definitely wanted to get at least one more use out of it. These little bags are a very easy way to do um, like goodie bags. And then like I said, I have, you know, a lot of like leftover decorations from Aubrey's birthday party. So I didn't really have to go and spend additional money on decorations. For food, we did like construct your own nachos. Again, I'm like using the same decorations. So it kind of it, it restricted me to a menu that I did for Aubrey's birthday, but that kind of made it easy for me that I didn't have to decide like a bunch of things and how they'd fit a theme or whatever. So one of the little highlights were these little traffic light pretzels. Now I made like a, the pretzel rod version with real size, like regular sized M&Ms for Aubrey's third birthday, but they weren't as popular, but these little pretzel sticks with mini M&Ms were definitely a hit. They, I'm almost fully cleared out, I have four left. And then something that was definitely all consumed were these little like brownies that I made uh, using like a donut mold and they were called spare tires. So I don't have any left to show you guys on that. And then one other thing uh, that I like definitely, I try to use what I make many times to feel like it was worth the time and effort I put in. So I made a bunch of these like origami, origami Christmas trees for Aubrey's frozen party and I decorated the table. And then this time around, I just put these green, like any of the green ones out on the table and used like all of Aubrey's little toy cars and had those out as decoration like around the food. So definitely makes it easy that Jack's birthday is in January, like winter time because this seems appropriate for right now. So anyways, we had a lot of fun. Uh, all I heard were positive things. So I was very happy about that because it was also like my birthday party celebration because my birthday is um, just like 10 days after Jack's. So it was nice to get those words of affirmation because that is my love language, like my primary love language. So anyways, it was, it was nice to hear those kind words. But now I am just gonna like, you know, try to tidy up just so that I'm more at peace with the cleanliness around here. My mom already did tons of work and I'm gonna be filming just a few things for the party cleanup video, just because it's, you know, who wants to clean up their birthday party? Not me, but I will do some of it for you guys. But even though this video is like short and sweet, I hope that it, it makes you excited for the party prep video, as well as um, like an undecorate from Christmas video. I just, you know, I've been so invested in getting all of the stuff filmed that I haven't had time to edit it. And I do not want to stay up until like 4 a.m. Uh, it, it's just, I've had too many nights like that recently. So I hope that makes you excited. If you are new here, I would love for you to stick around and subscribe to see those videos. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Woohoo! You've made it to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday, you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.